hey guys welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be taking you through my wash day routine hence the reason why i look so ragged so please bear with me <laughs> so many of you requested me to show you how i wash my hair after unraveling my protective style so i unraveled my style yesterday and let me show you guys how my hair looks like so this is how it looks like but this was after doing a hot oil treatment overnight so i used um, Shea by Asal hair growth stimulator which has coconut oil, shea oil, black seed oil, sweet, um, sweet almond oil, rosemary oil and vitamin E oil. So this is what I use to um, apply on my hair in sections. So I just parted my hair in sections and then I applied it and slept with it overnight. So my hair was super super dry after undoing the braids. This hot oil treatment just helps it uh, regain its moisture and prepares it for all the detangling process. So remember before you shampoo your hair you have to do a pre-put treatment just to prepare your hair for the shampoo process. So this also served as my pre-put treatment. Today I'm going to be showing you the rest of the routine from my shampoo routine, deep conditioning routine and moisturizing routine. So yeah, if you want to see that, keep watching. Please ignore the harsh light from the window behind me. Anyway, I'm applying my shampoo bar directly on my scalp. This is just to make sure that I get rid of all the dirt and all the gunk that I've accumulated on my scalp for the past uh, one month. I think I haven't washed my hair in a month. As you can see, I absolutely love this shampoo. It lathers really, really well and it's able to get rid of all the dirt that I have. I'm just rinsing it with warm water and then I'll go ahead and also do a second wash this is because my hair is absolutely dirty like <laughs> guys when I say that my hair is dirty I mean it anyway I usually don't apply the shampoo directly on my hair because the shampoo lather always runs down my hair shaft to remove all the dirt that has accumulated on my strands Uh, so after rinsing the shampoo out, I'll just go ahead and do a black tea rinse. Now this black tea rinse uh, is essential because it really helps to stop shedding and reduce breakage. It also helps to promote healthy hair. So I'm going to be explaining this uh, further in a separate video. But anyway, as you can see, I just spritz it directly on my scalp and also on my hair strands. And then I'm just going to be massaging it in. Anyway, now I'm just going to section my hair and I'm going to let that marinate on my hair for a while as I detangle. So I'm taking my VO5 conditioner and I'm applying it per section. So as you can see, I'm just gently detangling my hair in sections. Conditioner makes it so much easier to get uh, through the strands. So remember, be gentle. Just take your time. You don't have to pull your hair just take your time just make sure you gently remove all the shed hair that you have so i always wash my hair in sections because it makes my wash day so much easier and it also helps me to retain some length so once i'm done i put that section away and work on the rest of the sections So this is all the hair that I shed during my detangling process. Now I'm just going ahead and rinsing it. So on to my favorite favorite part which is my deep conditioning session. I'm taking my Mkado deep conditioner and I'm just working that on my hair. So I like using the praying hands method just to make sure that all my strands are completely coated with this product. So I'm just working that in and then putting that section away so that I can also work on the rest of the hair. Deep conditioning our hair is really really essential because it helps us to retain moisture throughout the week. 
as you can see this product glides on very smoothly on my hair and makes it super super soft I love it I'm done with all the sections and I'm taking a paper bag and wrapping it all over my head and then I'm going to put a plastic cup on and also an aluminium cup just to trap heat and then I'll let that marinate for 30 minutes so after 30 minutes I'm going ahead and rinsing my hair using warm water and I really like doing this under running water so I'm just making sure that I remove all the shedded hair Now that I'm done with all the sections, I'm doing an oil rinse using coconut oil to promote shiny hair and softer hair. Also help in eliminating frizz and help us to retain more moisture. So I'm just working that in and then I'm going to be rinsing it out with warm water just to get rid of the excess oil and also remove any shed hair. So this is normally the last step of my wash day in the shower. I just spray cold aloe vera juice all over my hair. Aloe vera juice is really, really amazing for our hair because it closes the cuticles and this helps us to retain moisture. Now I'm just covering my head with a t-shirt to dry the hair. I'm finally done with my wash process and now I'm going to be moisturizing it. I'm using Buyu Daily Leave-In Conditioner from Harvest of Sunshine and I'm just going to be working that on my hair. I usually don't apply a lot of leave-in as you can see that's the only uh, amount that I'm putting in. Make sure you get those ends guys our ends are the most important part of our hair because they are prone to more breakage so you just want to make sure that you get all the product in there and then seal in that moisture with coconut oil two strand twist that section and then proceed to work on the rest of the sections. My hair absolutely loves this leave-in conditioner. Just look at that, curls are already popping. It has a great amount of sleep and leaves my hair very, very soft. It's a little bit over a year since I got my tapered cut and I feel like my hair has significantly grown. I mean, apart from all the shedding and breakage that I've experienced throughout uh, the previous year, I feel like I've been able to retain a bit of length. So maybe I should do a hair update video. I don't know, you guys, let me know in the comment section below if you want me to do an updated hair video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video my hair feels super soft and is absolutely clean i'm just happy that i had a successful wash day anyway if you guys like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe to my channel to show support i'll see you guys in the next one bye